Hey guys, Nicole here with Nesting Haven. Today I have a Salvation Army Thrift Health to share with you. So I'll go ahead and start down here. The first thing I grabbed was this really neat six piece cubby um, display piece. Now this was $149. I'm not sure if I want to chalk paint this or maybe just put a patterned fabric or something on just the back drop of it because when I display pieces in my booth on darker items like this often it doesn't really pop very well um, so I think I'm going to at least put something on the back of the cubby spots I think that's a really cool shelf though so I was happy to get that I also picked up this cool corner piece shelving I like it has this like kind of scalloped I don't know if scallops the right word. <laughs> There's a little bit of a detailing here. And the corner of the booth is actually really difficult for me to um, kind of squeeze some stuff in there. So I was happy to find this and I'll definitely be painting that some, some kind of fun color, more likely a blue. I kind of got a blue theme going on right now. So um, kind of this, probably like a teal blue. I also picked up these milk glass, uh, jugs I don't know <laughs> um, you can actually get these at the Dollar Tree uh, when they have them in I did pick up a couple of these last fall um, I'm not sure if they'll get them back in but I grabbed them because there was two of them for 99 cents and these look great with farmhouse decor so I'll just go ahead and resell those in my booth I also got this floral piece here it is a tile and then it has this really nice wood frame around it it was only 49 cents and I'll just go ahead and clean that up a little bit and add that to my floral collection. Now this glass here I thought was really pretty and I got excited when I saw this because I was like oh I can probably um, look that up and see you know that maker but it's actually the Gazania Ringens treasure flower is actually just the name of what this flower is called. So I don't really know anything about this glass. <laughs> um, so it was only 49 cents and I thought it was super pretty anyways. So I had to grab that. And then I picked up a set of four of these really pretty rose pink striped coffee mugs. They were 49 cents a piece. They are by Corning USA. I thought it was kind of funny. It says microwave okay. <laughs> Usually you see microwave safe or something. So it's the first time I ever saw that. I thought that was kind of funny. But yeah, those are super cute. And then I got this coffee sign here. I thought it had that old kind of retro feel to it. It was only $1.99. I'll put that in my booth to resell. I also grabbed this really cool picture here. This was only $1.49. It is by the brand, oh, what does that say? Frigidaire or something? Fridge, no, Frig, fr, frig Frigidberry or something? <laughs> I don't know <laughs> however you pronounce that. But they actually sell these um, online still. Oh, right here, what does this say? Focus, focus. There we go. So Bor Borminian Rocco, Italy. So I guess that's what, it, maybe that was Italian. <laughs> the Frigerio, whatever. Um, they still sell these online for around $20. So I mean, I don't think they're really vintage, but I just thought it was really cute. I like the style of it. So um, yeah, I'm more than likely I'm gonna keep that for myself and just make some iced tea or something in it for the summer. I also picked up this Chefin um, salad dressing maker. It was only 99 cents and it has like recipes on the outside of it here. So I thought that was pretty neat. We got balsamic vinaigrette, uh, Greek salad dressing, and honey mustard vinaigrette. So you got three dressings on it. You just uh, put them in there and pump it like this and it turns. Is that working? I think it was just working, yeah. So you can do that. I am more likely gonna just resell this because I usually just take a mason jar, put the lid on and 
give it a shake, but um, well, it was a cool piece anyways, and I really like the green color to it. So I'll be reselling that. It's a random chip clip on the table. <laughs> um, so this is a cute piece from Avon. Has the raspberries and blackberries, I guess. <laughs> They're a little dark purple for raspberry, I think, but um, that's what it looks like to me. Um, this is from 1985, and I just thought that was a cute little collector's plate. I got that for 99 cents. I'll put that in the booth. I picked up this Betty Crocker recipe library index uh, kit. It was $2.99. This is from, I believe, 1971. It has most of the recipes. You see that children's parties, that's a cool category. Um, I, I super love this stuff. I think it's so fun. I, I think homemaking is such a cool thing to do. You know, I think God called us to be homemakers as women. I know a lot of people maybe don't necessarily like that anymore, but um, I, I consider myself a homemaker and I really enjoy this stuff. And I think that would be, would have been a really cool time to be in and you know, where it was a little bit more acceptable to be a homemaker. And yeah, I just really like this. I think this is cool. So I'll be keeping that for myself. And then I got, Sorry, my kid wanted to come back inside. He was outside with my husband, and I guess he was all done playing. So, um, anyways, I picked up these four milk glass pieces. Now, <laughs> I have a love-hate relationship with milk glass. I, I pick it up all the time, and then I kind of, like, declutter it and put it in my booth. And um, But I saw, saw these with the larger ones. I've never seen this come in the larger ones, and I don't know, just seeing them all together... Like, I already had some of these that I think I decluttered them, <laughs> but um, seeing them all together, I don't know, I just kind of liked them. I have a lot of my milk glass now. I have my plants, my house plants in them, and the background kind of looks a little bare, so I thought this would look nice just to kind of put in as a backdrop to them, and they're all 99 cents a piece, so yeah, I picked up those. I actually really like this kind of style of the milk glass. So I was happy to get those. I like, I particularly like the larger ones here. And then, I don't know, these are anchor hawking. Um, I think they're anchor hawking. I believe so. <laughs> I think that's the symbol. Um, punch cups, and they were $1.99. I got a set of eight of them. They did come with a couple of these rings that you could put on the punch bowl itself. I didn't have a full set of eight of those, but I don't know, I just thought they were fun. I like the clear glass um, ones, and I just thought it'd be fun to have for uh, on hand for a party, or to put in my booth and maybe someone else can enjoy. I'm not quite sure, I just I thought it was a good deal and I wanted to get them. And the last thing I grabbed was this really neat piece here. It was $2.49, and I, I'm pretty sure originally it's for to display thread on, but I have washi tape and I thought this would be, would be a great display piece for washi to be able to access it and kind of see it all. Um, I used to be really big into planning, uh, doing like Erin Condren planners and stuff, but since kids I really haven't had time to do that as much. Um, I'm lucky if I can jot down a to-do list real quick. And um, I really want to get back into that, so I want to start organizing my planner stuff again and maybe start doing some Plan With Me videos or whatnot. So yeah, I got that. It's super, super big. There's one, two, three, four, five tiers of them, so I can fit a ton on that. Super happy with that. So that's all I picked up at Salvation Army today, guys. I hope you enjoyed what I picked up. Please let me know below what your favorite item was, and be sure to give this video a like. And go ahead and consider subscribing if you're not subscribed already, and we will catch you next time.